bunch of people who have less and less interest in us. Scott Simpson. Mr Speaker, it's a pleasure to rise and take a short call in support of this uh, Royal Succession Bill, notwithstanding Andrew Little's papist Republican rant. Uh, it's something that is important to us. It's a small bill, Mr Speaker. It's a small bill, but it's an important bill. And it's easy sometimes to make light of things that sometimes on the face of it seem a little, trivi a little trivial and a of little consequence. However, this bill is something that makes a small but very significant and important change to our basic constitutional arrangements. For many people, it would seem unusual that our parliament and parliaments in the other 15 Commonwealth realms have to pass special legislation to ensure that in future royal succession will be gender neutral. These days, sir, it seems by our standards of society that anything other than a gender neutral royal succession would be something completely unacceptable in a modern society. This bill, sir, is not long. It's not complicated. It does not seek to change anything in terms of our constitutional monarchy other than to modernise the rules surrounding succession by removing aspects of gender and religious discrimination. And with the birth last year of Prince George, it's going to be many years, sir, before the practical implications of this bill will have any impact at all. That of itself is not important. What is important is that the change has been made and will have effect in due course. And now, when necessary, no matter how far into the future that is, the succession will be uh, a succession that is appropriate and fitting by modern current society standards. Sir, it was a pleasure to chair the Justice and Electoral Select Committee as we considered submissions on the bill. We received seven submissions. We heard from four, and we made just one minor technical uh, amendment to do with the uh, time uh, uh, to relate to Greenwich Mean Time and Summer Time and those sorts of things. So it was a very, it was a very minor change. But it's a narrow bill, sir. It um, uh, uh, didn't have any scope to consider the Republican uh, issues that uh, Andrew Little raised. And it's important that our constitutional institutions maintain their history and traditions, and I support those. Uh, but it's also important that the rules that govern those institutions evolve and sometime they change with the expectations of a changing society. This bill is a classic example of how our system can and does work to accommodate natural evolution. New Zealand is a young nation, Mr Speaker. We have a proud tradition of progressive history, uh, of progressive uh, social change within our history. This is a good bill. It's a small but simple bill. It's a bill with a simple and obvious intention. It's a bill that helps keep our constitutional monarchy relevant and in step with modern thinking. It's a bill I support and I commend to the House. Honourable Mary Ann Street. Thank you, Mr Speaker. It gives me uh, great pleasure to rise to speak to the Royal Succession Bill.